You may have noticed that after a really hot curry, water will just not cut it. It will not soothe you as you drink it. But why is that? It's all to do with the type of solvent that water is. In this video, I'm going to explain to you why some things dissolve in polar solvents like water and other things dissolve in non-polar solvents like hexane. Water and hexane are two common solvents in the lab and you'll find that some things will dissolve in water but not in hexane and some things will dissolve in hexane but not in water. And the reason why is because of these little delta positive delta negative charges here. Water is polar. It has a polarity on the molecule whereas hexane isn't polar. In a giant iron lattice, we have positive ions and we have negative ions. And remember, these are not attracted to each other in a one-to-one -one ratio. Each ion is attracted to lots of other ions, and the ones in front and the ones behind it as well. So this is our giant iron lattice, where each individual ion is attracted, sometimes strongly, really strongly to the close ones, and not so strongly to the ones the far away, but attracted to lots of different ions. Now these electrostatic interactions are very strong. It takes a large amount of energy to break them, which is high. It has a high melting point and a high boiling point. But water can break down these bonds quite easily. Water, because it is polar, has tiny little areas uh, which are more negative and more positive. So water can come in and several water molecules will come in and surround this positive sodium here. And they'll kind of like wiggle that way in between and it will slowly break down the lattice as it is dissolving, as the water molecules are surrounding the ions. The lattice is going to get disrupted and the ions are going to be pulled out of it by the slight charges on whatever polar substance it might be could be water, could be something else. So you're going to get each positive ion from the lattice surrounded by the negative end of the polar molecule and each negative ion within the lattice surrounded by the delta positive end of the polar molecule.